Hey, people of Hope, it's Pastor Mike Toomey. Thank you for doing your soul business on this day and watching this video. Say, so today I am doing this devotion and I really didn't want to do it because it deals with the ugliness that happens in our society, in fact, within our community. Over the past days and weeks, the topic of spray paint and religion has come up. And not too long ago, somebody took a can of spray paint and they spray painted a statue of Jesus. And then somebody else took another can of spray paint and spray painted words of hate and anger all over a Muslim mosque. Folks, neither of those ways is how we as Christian people are to live our lives in this world. Those ways are filled with frustration, hate, anger, and malice. As I study the Holy Scriptures, I know this to be the truth about when they were written. They were written when people were politically and religiously divided. And yet the command to Christian people is to follow Jesus and to behave like him as best we can in this world. In the letter to the church in Ephesus, it reads like this and speaks that truth directly into your life and in mine. It says, do not let any unwholesome talk come out of your mouths, but only what is helpful for building others up according to their needs, that it may benefit those who listen. And do not grieve the Holy Spirit of God with whom you were sealed for the day of redemption. Get rid of all bitterness, rage, and anger, brawling, slander, along with every form of malice. And then the letter goes on to give us a much larger vision of how you and I are to act in this world. Be kind. Be compassionate to one another. Forgive each other, just as in Christ God forgave you. Follow God's example, therefore, as dearly loved children, and walk in the way of love. Walk in the way of love, just as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us as a fragrant offering and sacrifice to God. What do we do in a religiously and politically divided world? We put away anger, bitterness, rage, and malice. And we follow Jesus, and we're kind, we're compassionate, and we offer ourselves up in love. God bless you folks, and let's follow him together.